Hi, I'm Sandra Louisa and this is the Let's Paint Club and today we are at the North Yorkshire Moors Railway at the Pickering Station and we're waiting for a train to come in. Zachary, what can you tell me about steam trains? What is it you like about them? Uh, I think it's just the rhythm of the chuffing actually. You like the sound of them yeah. as they're chuffing along? Yeah, actually I like the rhythm because it goes chuff chuffy bum, chuff chuffy chuff, like that. Mm, any favourite uh, locomotives? and J27. And here she comes. Is it the Eric Tracy? Oh, look at that. There's something about steam, it's so nostalgic, but they're like a living, breathing machine, aren't they? that steam and listen to the sounds of the engine. Fantastic. I'm using it. What do you reckon to that then dear? So we've got the 76079, the Moorland, the Moorlander. And he said Moorland Islander, that wouldn't be right, would it? <laughs> I'm checking the lines clear. Seven, seven, six, eight, seven, nine, which is the BR standard class four. Like it's class four. It's a class four. Since you tender version, uh, sorry, so hang on a second. The last of the class to be built at Porridge in 1957, seven, six, eight, seven, nine, had a short BR career working in the Northwest with 115 other members of the class that were distributed throughout the BR from Portland to Glasgow.
Right, so I'm going to have a little go at drawing um, an image from one of the steam trains yesterday. It's a few swirls of steam. I really am attracted to that steam effect that's covering the floor of the cab because the weather's cold and the water's condensed and you can see all this lovely steam everywhere so it's just nice to put that in. Sorry, I'm just starting to add some colour now and then I should wash that out with pencil and see if we can get that nice steamy effect in the cab and the heat inside the cab of the orange against the blue, blues and purples.